any of this, however, comes inspiration. And inspiration can strike anywhere. For a young woman, it was her frantic search for a simple white shirt after she spilled coffee on herself right before a business meeting. For something as simple as a basic white shirt, it was just so hard to get that I wondered if I was the only one. Once I found out that there were, it wasn't just me, there were so many more women who missed well-fit western non-casual wear that uh, the idea of Karya kind of came together. Karya actually completely reinvented the way sizing was approached for women. We developed an algorithm with, which allows women to, with only three inputs, get their size first time right 85% of the time. As far as the back end is concerned, we are not manufacturing and keeping, so just by virtue of that, we are not pushing product out, we are only creating or making what the customer really wants. So we actually go from order to dispatch within 48 hours. From idea to implementation, Nidhi soon found out that in the startup world, while it doesn't hurt to be a woman, it certainly helps to be a man. She was turned down 113 times before getting a yay from the biggest names. The largest problem that I had actually faced was the ability to gather funds. Of course, my friends and family put in all they had in terms of my seed fund. Uh, and now the Saha fund has invested in us as well. And thankfully so, we got funded by Mr. Ratan Tata back in May and June this year. Karya did not get funded because it was a woman-led business. Karya certainly, uh, in a, on a lot of occasions, did not not get funded because it was a woman-led business. For example,